Hello once again, and um, unfortunately when I was recording this episode, I somehow managed to miss my voice off, so this is going to be a little bit of a post commentary, and shiz like that, I'm sorry, and um, yeah, it's a little bit eventful this one, we decided we go for the, well the, um, the revenge one, no we did the revenge one, I have no idea, my mind is completely muffled, oh we're going for the meet the boss, that's what we're doing. We gotta do something Shut about this, man. Shut the fuck up, man. Jackie. We gotta think. You gotta think. Don't call me. Bing, bing, bing. Come here. Bing, 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 bing. Shut up, both of you. Winston's gone. Right now, we gotta stick together. We just can't let the 18K get away with this. What makes you so sure it was 18K? We all saw them. They were definitely 18K. Even stupid Jackie knows that. You ever think maybe they were just trying to look like 18K? Look, we've had a few skirmishes with them lately, but nothing major. It doesn't make sense that they would do something this big. Oh, oh, so, so, so who do you think it was? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. <clears throat> and who the fuck are you? I'm here for Mr. Lee. I take it you've heard of Big Smile Lee. He's another son on ye boss, Red Bull, just like Winston. Okay, what can we do for Mr. Lee? He has decided that for the time being, you may continue your operations in this area. But the percentage previously paid to Winston will now go to Mr. Lee. Hell no. That's an interesting proposition. But I have a counteroffer from Mr. Lee. I'd appreciate if you relay this back to him word for word. Can you do that? You tell Mr. Lee that his people stay the fuck out of our territory and in return, we'll let him live. I don't think you'll find that offer to his liking. I think you'll find that I don't give a fuck. You see our guest out, make sure he doesn't get lost. You'll regret this. I promise you that. Didn't do a very good job of showing him out, did they? Didn't notice that before. And that is probably why they ransack the place, so let's go fucking murder them. Go away! Now, during this episode I was having trouble, um, shooting. Like, I was clicking the mouse button and nothing was happening, and I couldn't really work it out. Yeah! So, um, there are some unfortunate <laughs> deaths like that one and other things that just kind of happened because I wasn't able to pull the trigger. Yeah, I apologize for that in advance, but yeah, they do happen. Sorry. Anyway, here we go. Bash down the door, kill the guy. I see the, you see the pause and it's like, why is the trigger not working? Oh, well, I have a gas gun. Pop him in the head. It's always the plan. Yeah, there you go. Hostile down. We didn't actually get that guy in the head. Oh, shit. I'll try to get this guy in the head instead. There we go, hot car down. Oh, we didn't actually get him in the head either. So, we have a little frame stutter, that's fun. Always wanted some of that. Get down here. And shoot him up. Shoot him up. Shoot him up. It, it's quite a manic little shooting thing. When it comes down to shooting like this, it quite, quite reminds me of um, Saints Row, if you've ever played that game. Where it's kind of crude, humorish, funny shooting over the top. I don't know, it feels a bit like that. I know it's probably meant to be slightly more serious, but I don't know, the way, to me, the way Sleeping Dog runs is a bit less serious. You know what, I mean? you know what I'm saying? Anyway, yeah, uh, let's continue. Pop him in the head. Always the best way to take him out. Now this bit's slightly embarrassing. I remember, I remember my mouse was playing up here, so I was trying to shoot them, and I was like, why is nothing happening, and dead. Start again. You suck, Taro. And yeah, so there we go. We're back, and we start all over once again. But it's fine, because this time we should do it super quickly by running up the side of the door, apparently. I didn't even realize that. We just killed the girl. <laughs> Which was an accident, but like, there we go. Now the mouse, as you can see, like we're, we're hovering over him, but we can't fucking kill him for some reason because my mouse is a bit of a, I don't know, having a bit of a tantrum, I guess. Silly mouse. Anyway, yeah, so we are uh, march on exactly the same, pretty much, as like five seconds ago. So sorry about that. If you're getting deja vu, so am I. Have no fear. So we we'll take these guys out. Not really too much of a problem. A couple of shots in the head, no, one shot in the head each, and uh, we move on, and we know exactly what's coming now, which is actually a great help, I, mean, I don't know if anyone ever says it, but 
hindsight is a great thing, and uh, <laughs> if 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 you had the ability of hindsight, man, or whatever, you would probably be incredibly powerful. So yeah. I do like Jackie. Jackie has some some character to So does this game, believe it or not. It's a very, very... There's a, quite a bit of character in this game, and there is conflict. You can see the conflict in in Wei's mind, and I just wonder... I don't know how Jackie got there, he must tell what the word is. What will how the game went, because um, it's not an obvious end to it. Get the car! Get the car! And here we go, more shooty up time. And this is where my mouse failed once again. And as you can see, I'm. Ch shit that guy out, you'll find. You'll, there's a part where my mouse will be. Well, the cursor, the crosshair will be over the guy. And I just can't, for some reason, pull the trigger. And it's just tapping my mouse with the main one. Yeah, this is it, right here. I can't shoot that guy, and then I got murdered. Yeah, fun! Woo! Start again. Temp 2. Exactly the same situation. That didn't actually happen. That was just a sneeze, boy. It was a... Uh, what's that movie? I quite enjoyed it as well. Ooh! That was I. <laughs> Everyone's seen it. It's, it's like mind-blowing. It's awesome. They go in dreams, they move up dream levels. Induction. Intervention? In... I can't remember. Whatever it's called, it's a good film. It reminds me of that. Only because I say so. Like, it's not actually anything like that. But yeah. <laughs> there is shooting in it. So we'll take these guys out badly. Um, we decided that... Well, I decided that it wasn't a good plan to kind of stick around and... You know, let them kill me. And I ran out of ammo on the big gun, so I just swapped to this and... For some reason it... Yeah, sticky keys there. You can hear the beeping. And I can't crouch now, I can't get into cover, so I was like, what is going on? And it's smashing out the uh, the control key, trying to trying to get to work, but nope, no scar. It's a shame, but there you go. It happened. It happened, fools, it happened. Left side. He's getting away! Come on, come on! And let's yeah, go. so we finished them off all nice and pretty. And we moved on. Step up on it! Chase him down. And we found out actually that Jackie is an incredible driver. Far better than me. No, that's not possible. I'm the best driver in Hong Kong. But you know, he, he drives so smoothly and he doesn't crash into things. It's actually amazing. So kudos, Jackie. You, you found your calling. You should become a driver of some kind. Because that seems to be the yeah. So he should definitely become some kind of driver, I'm guessing. Anyway, murder, murder, murder. Basically, how it rolls in Hong Kong. So yeah. I'm sorry if this audio is a little bit you know off, but it's. Difficult because it comes with these buffers. You know, I've already done. I've already got the file. I have a raw file, of course. It's yeah, I'm sorry. See, and again, I, I have to constantly pause the recording so that I try not to get out of time. Which is interesting. Yeah, we're basically just throwing bullets away and trying to kill as many people as possible. It's quite an interesting little chase. Quite fun. I quite enjoyed this bit. Actually, look at it now, the text, the, the background and stuff, the city is very well done. I mean, I'm playing on quite low graphics, and I know it's not the prettiest thing ever, but then, then again, what city is the prettiest thing ever, you know? It's, um, it's interesting. Hmm. I'd say so. So we shoot them up, we blow them up, we kill them all, we move on out. Basically, we're aiming for the tires here because it seems to be the best, best, best method. Yep, like that one, we didn't even hit near the things. That crosshair was like absolutely nowhere near. Couldn't work out where that guy was going. He must have just taken the wrong route, I guess. Maybe he decided he didn't want to die like all his friends. 
probably isn't the worst thing to say or to be honest. He did just watch all his friends die, which is uh, never the nicest thing ever. So anyway. This guy's hardcore. But guess what? We've done them all. No way you get away, clean ponytail! No way! And um, because I don't really have an awful lot to actually input right now, um, I may leave you. I'm sorry. Um, I think I probably will. Uh, I'll leave you to it. You can have a little watch and I'll go if you want. If not, I'm sorry. Leave now. Or forever hold your tongue and I'll see you again next time. Sorry about that. And good night. <laughs> No way you get away clean, Ponytail! No way! Tell your boss, stay the fuck out of my territory. Fuck you away. Just what I needed. Oh, made me chase you. Hey, Spock, freeze. Hey, Spock, freeze. Get in. Get in. What the hell? Get back here, coward. Who the fuck are you guys? Change your tongue, shit. Miss Yang is a red pole, and she just saved your life. Miss Jang? Broken nose Jang? My apologies, oh, Madam Red Pole. So why'd you bring me out here? I have heard a lot about you, Wei Shen. <laughs> I will get to the point. You must realize that you cannot stand against Big Smile Lee alone. That's what everyone tells me. Roland Ho said I'd need other bosses to support me. Indeed. Nah, I believe in harmony, balance, peace, and I don't mind spilling a little blood to achieve it. 
With Uncle Po in the hospital, there's much uncertainty in the Sun on Yi. If he recovers, we will both be stable and strong. But if he dies? The 18K presents a very real threat. We cannot afford to appear weak. We will need to elect a new chairman quickly. <laughs> you, for instance. Ah, Big Smile Lee represents a step backwards for the Sun on Yi. Why continue to force girls into prostitution and pornography when there are other, less archaic, more profitable ways for us to make money? I have very different ideas about our future. I want to take the sun on ye forward, but it would be unwise even for me to stand against Big Smile Lee unaided, which brings me to you. Nah, we both appear to have the same problem, Wei Shen and the opportunity to benefit if we work together. So it seems. I have my own reasons for hating Big Smiley's operation. Now, if you stand against him, you can count on me. Good. We will talk soon. Zhou Tao Le Ha, Wei Shen. Hey, man. Wait! You won't believe what those assholes did! Who? Those guys at Top Glamour, they're fucking with me! I brought them another load of watches. They were supposed to give me 200,000 for them. Instead, they give me this hunk of shit. I don't even know how to ride this thing. I had to push it here. Calm down. Give me the bike. I'll get you your money. What are you gonna do? Same thing I always do, Jackie. Let me in? All right, come on in. What do you want? My friend Jackie tells me you owe him some money. You're sitting on it. And where'd you get off strong-arming me, huh? I know you're a cop. And I know you're a snitch. You want to see who your boys kill first? Fuck you. Kill him! Kill him!
That's it, asshole. Come on, fuckers! Come on, be a... Inspector, I have one of your informants in the trunk of my car. What? Yeah, he needs to disappear right now. So either you make him disappear or I will. Bring him over. Take care of it. Where he's going, he won't be in a position to tell anyone anything. <coughs> hey, I can hear you! <coughs> what the fuck are you doing out there? Open the fucking truck, will you? <coughs> hey, show the lady some respect. 